These forgottenlings died a natural death. As they reached a certain age, they just quietly crystallized. It's actually quite beautiful. How long before that happens to me? About a day, I'd say. Will it hurt? Not at all. I'm not ready for this. Then why don't we go get the Arca back? What? But I thought... I never wanted you distilled. I don't want to see you crystallized either. Then what do we do? I want to give you the Arca and get you out of here. How? Bob keeps the Arca safe at his house. I don't understand. I need you to distract him long enough for me to steal it. What? Afterwards, you escape and meet me on the surface. Take this map. Your escape route is marked on it. And you'll just give the Arca back after all that, of course. You are really looking forward to life as a crystal, aren't you? <sighs> Why are you helping me? I believe in you. Here's the plan. Bob wants to use the Arca to attack Bunker. That's why he has sent for a specialist, a forgotten who knows the layout of the tower grounds. You will pose as that specialist. How am I supposed to do that? I have a friend waiting for you in the storage room. He'll fill you in. Wait, are we doing it right now? We have no time to lose. I'll create a diversion so you can get out of here unseen. It's time for me to speak up. Fellow Forgotlings, I see before me a group with the potential to do anything. Difficult times are ahead, sure, but we have overcome difficult times in the past. We will not let Bonku manipulate us into seeing the world through his eyes. We are not objects. We are not inferior. I'm asking you to trust me, and that's not a small thing to ask. But I assure you, I have a plan. I will leave you for a short while very soon. But I will be back. And if everything goes as planned, tables will have turned. I might even be able to see the map again. Her best action is to make Casper long. Surprise! You? In the ink. I escaped. So you did. Let's get it on you. Get what on me? The disguise I made for you. You can change behind that screen. Amazing. Don't make fun. No, no, it's even better than I imagined. Bob won't suspect a thing. Really? Here's the plan. Bob has the Arca in his house. We're gonna get it back. How will you do that? I will present you to Bob as the specialist. And when we're in his house, you make sure to keep him busy. Meanwhile, I open a window so Fig can steal the Arca. Simple. It won't work. As usual, you forgot Link have no idea what you're doing or what's at stake. Oh, you're just tired. I understand. Trust me, it'll work. But he might recognize your voice, so you'd better not speak. How can I keep Bob busy without speaking? Trust me, Bob will do the talking. You just nod and shake your head. Literally. What if I need to get your attention? Then wave and make some kind of sound. Let's try. Can you nod? Like you're confirming what I say. Ha! Yes! Perfect! Very convincing. Now, let's have you shake your head like you're disagreeing. Yes, it works! Bob won't suspect a thing. Now, let's try the wave. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> That's fantastic! There's an actor hidden in you, Anne. You're ready. Let's go get your Arca back. Yeah, that's the spirit. I'll meet you at Bob's house. I was rather pleased with Bulb's leadership. He did get results, but I'm talking about a long-term resolution to the conflict. Affirmative. That would be acceptable. But Fig is too liberal. The limits of quality in themselves? I say we need discipline, order, 
Bold is the right for Godling to provide that. If that's what you want, only time will tell if you get it. The leaders should work together. We could have- There you are. Ready? I'm counting on you. Keep him busy. Let's go. Yes. Oh, Quill, you're here with the specialist. Perfect. Come in. I don't remember seeing your friend before. Ah, Bold. A joker as always. Of course, you recognize the great Crate Boxton. He's had key roles on several missions to the Tower Grounds. And I don't have to mention the incident in this morning's operation, I take it. Oh, Crate Boxton. Certainly, of course. I'm honored. That was quite a... a thing you did. He, uh, he doesn't talk much after the incident. I'm sure you understand. Of course. Well, come with me. I've got the plans for our next mission upstairs. Keep him busy. This, Mr. Boxton, is the plan of our next attack on the tower grounds. With your expertise, I'm sure we can improve it. The watchtower has always been a problem for us, but during the last mission, we sabotaged the gates. My hope is that you have information about exactly how much damage we inflicted. Can we walk straight through the watchtower now? I see. That's news to me. I'll plot that in on the plan. What about the workshop? This morning's attack revealed that the last segment of the ether bridge is kept there. Did you see anyone guarding it? Really? No guards? That's great news. I guess he relied completely on the enforcer. We have a chance of destroying the last bridge segment then. Excellent. Any other security measures at the workshop? Mirrors, perhaps. I see. So we might be able to get in after all. Splendid. By the way, those are some peculiar boots you have. Where have I seen boots like that before? They remind me of... Say, Bald, did you know that Mr. Boxton is also very well informed about anima systems and Arca theory? Really? That's wonderful timing. I have so many questions. Let's go downstairs. Between you and me, I'm experimenting with the Arca. I'm close to figuring out how to wield it. See the schematics, Mr. Boxton. I've tried to map out how the Arca works. If my theory is correct, we're just scratching the surface of what this thing can do, and so is the Enforcer. Look, doesn't it seem like the Arca can actually store anima? Really? I got it right. I bet you had a similar theory, didn't you? I knew it! The Arca can store anima! Remarkable! Fig, that wooden wimp is too scared to use it. I think we can do great things with the Arca. Are we on the same page, Mr. Boxton? Of course, a seasoned veteran such as yourself can recognize an opportunity when he sees it. Hey, you, Plumage, no snooping around. Stay down here. No one goes upstairs without my permission. Did you hear me? I don't want you upstairs. Oh, of course not. I understand. Say, why don't you ask the Enforcer? <laughs> what I meant was, why don't you inform Mr. Boxton about your Arca theory? Oh, yes, I think you'll like this. My other theory is that the Arca could be among the very first crystals in existence. Perhaps even the one with which our whole world originated. What do you think about that, Mr. Boxton? <laughs> yes, um... I see. I'm not quite sure how to interpret your answer, Mr. Boxton. However, my theory has... Hey! What's going on? I thought I told you no snooping around. You sneaky feather duster. What do you think you're doing? There! That sly little forger. Sorry about this, Mr. Boxton. I have to see if everything is all right with the Arca. Imagine. I could be the Forgotling who discovers how to reverse the crystallization process.
Yes, yes, I'm on my way. I don't understand. Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What do you mean? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. We're here, now what is it? Why did you? You lured me down here, didn't you? You want the Arca for yourself. No, no, that's absurd. I'm sorry, Mr. Boxton, but I am surrounded by forgotlings who lust for power and can't be trusted. What? No! No, no, no! It's gone! No, no, no! That was my last chance! I'm finished! This is it! I'm done for! I'll find that thief and make him pay! Has anyone seen the Enforcer? Or that sly little quill? Who goes there? Oh, good day to you, sire. May I inquire about your errand? Oh, it must be important then. Perhaps even top secret. What have I missed? There must be an order that did not reach me. Oh, I missed an order. Am I right? <laughs> Say no more, I understand. How bad is the situation? <laughs> it is even worse than I thought. I must spring into action. Fear not, help is on the way. promised he'd be here. Anne, Anne, do you hear me? Oh, don't let it be too late. Anne, Anne, please give me a sign. Anne, wake up. Anne, oh, thank goodness. I waited and waited. Where were you? I'm sorry, Anne. Getting out proved harder than I thought. The whole place is in an uproar after your escape and the disappearance of the Arca. Why are you helping me? I told you. I believe in you. And you're essential to bringing peace between the Forgottenings and Bonku. That's what Master Bonku is trying to do. I know. But I'm confident you will succeed where he has failed. Before we do anything else, I have to show you the plant. The plant? Why? Let's call it the price of my help. 
I don't see what good it'll do. It's important, and you owe me a favor. I'm not sure what you're up to, but you did save my life. Don't go thinking I'm suddenly on your side, though. Are you on Blanket's side, then? Blanket is... I don't know. A lot has happened, and I don't understand most of it. Just show me what you want me to see. Come with me. The answers will follow. Follow me, Anne. 